Hello everyone, Mark here, Mark's Max Muscle, and the pre-judging has just concluded for the 2023 Orlando Pro, and if you're like me, you were searching for a live stream, you were probably caught watching this on Phil Klahar's live stream on Instagram, that's where I was watching it, so was Ian Valier. I was actually going to do a live and give you guys a play-by-play, -play, but, you know, it's over now. So maybe, maybe for the finals, I will do a live, let you guys know what's going on. Pitchers are few and far between. There is just this one screenshot of Phil Klahar and Hassan Mustafa. Guys, this is your top two. This is your top two. And I hope you guys didn't click on this video to see good, clean shots or video footage of these guys. Just some information. Just some information. So yeah, Phil Klahar makes it to your top two. Did Hassan Mustafa do enough to clinch the victory for this one? I think so, yeah, I think so, yeah. But he did not improve. If you're asking me if he improved from the uh, from the Toronto, I, I would say no. I would say no. His midsection was a little bit much. But I think, considering Phil Klahar, uh, hey, he looks good. Phil looks good. And to secure a second-place finish, that's it, it, not bad. That's not bad. But I just don't think that he did enough to... Uh, to defeat Hassan Mustafa. Now, there was a, a call-out before this, your first call-out. Um, Phil, of course, was in there, and Hassan, obviously. They had Mohamed al Nasor. he was there as well. Stan Dulongo. Stan looks awesome. The Stanimal, in my opinion, he looks friggin' awesome. Wouldn't be surprised if they didn't give him third. Wouldn't be surprised at all. And Emmanuel Alvarez... He also made it into, into that uh, first call-out situation. So EP09, a little credit to him for for giving uh, Emmanuel Alvarez a shout-out. So he deserved it. But yeah, yeah, I apologize, guys. Like I said, maybe I'll do a live stream commentary. Let you guys know, play-by-play. -play. Watching this on Phil Klahar's live stream, Ian Valier popped in. He was watching it there. So was EP09. So was Bodybuilding News Network. We were all there. Trying to get a glimpse, catch a glimpse of the winner of the Orlando Pro. If I had to go by, you know, what I've seen, I think Hassan's going to win it with not a very impressive fashion. Hey, all due respect, I just think he looked better in Toronto. Midsection, like I said, was a little bit, a little bit thicker. And that is, uh, that's what we're looking at first when it comes to Hassan. Because that's his weak point. We always look for the weak points here at Mark's Max Muscle. Terrible, terrible. Hit thumbs up. I will keep you guys updated on what's going on, what is what, and uh, if anybody slips into that first call-out, aside from uh, Phil. But I doubt it. I doubt it. Have a great one, guys.